I'm going to show you how cold it is. That's ice. Is that white? That's ice. Oh, look at that. That's ice. Oh, my God. That's ice. Oh, I was going to be camping in this last night. Oh, look at that. That is frozen solid. No wonder I was freezing my ass off last night. And a heater and everything. The heater cocked it in the middle of the night. This is the room. It's not uh, it's not anything flash, that's for sure. But um, yeah, with how cold it is, I think I'm gonna have to um book this room a few more nights. I couldn't sleep out that cold. Beautiful view to wake up to. I just love looking at the way these hills have formed and it's just So I'm gonna go up and um go up and see Dave now. I met Dave yesterday out on the tracks. Come back and beers with him last night. He's staying at the caravan park, which is part of this but it's up out of the way a little bit up here so I'll um go and say good day see if he's woken up oh I need to get these heated grips going Whew. yeah so after my ride yesterday I'm really starting to come to love this bike it's um it's a very capable bike for exploring Australia on does it all good morning sunshine good oh that's what I like to see boots going on <laughs> raring to go oh she's brisk fuck I forgot my hopefully I didn't drive hey I'm just down here at the green thing I've just got to go back and make sure my battery pack, I thought I put it on, but it's... Oh, okay. <sighs> um, I'm going to check the service station and you on your way out the door pretty much. Yeah, yeah see you there at five. Yeah, my, um, my hip pouch. I hope I didn't ride off with it sitting on the back seat. It's got all my batteries in it. Oh, look at that. I left it on the back seat. Fucking lucky. So lucky. Come on, Scott. Fucking hell, man. Hopefully, it hasn't been driven over. I don't think anyone would have been up here just yet. Ah, oh, man, it's got my beacon in there. Emergency beacon. This is a uh, somewhere I've got to bring my daughter. She always asking me what rocks this, Dad. What rocks that? This is telling you what they are. Hang on. Can't wait to get in amongst these hills. <laughs> it's going to be fun. You want to get out in front so you're not eating my dust all day? We'll take turns choking on dust. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look, no, I have to just. Yeah, so Dave's um, staying an extra couple of days, I think, because the weather's pretty nasty that he's got to return to when he goes back to Victoria. So if he just waits it out, he can wait here and avoid having to ride through miserable weather for five, six hundred kilometres, however long it is. I love the reds and the greens just blending into each other. Uh, I tell ya, I wasn't wrong, you cannot go wrong here everywhere, it's just stunning. Look at that, that's been turned on its side. Wow, hey. Even this river through here is stunning, wow.
Looks like we were meant to go that um, that left back there. Right. I don't know what that means. No idea. Uh, we're not camping. I think it's to camp. We'll go and have a look. <laughs> wow. I don't know, this is nice. I did see a <coughs> toilet sign out here too, which I might be visiting shortly. No entry without permit. There is an entry fee payable to visit da -da 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 -da. this fee is used da -da -da -da. where how do you pay it though is what you need to what's that? Oh what cool. Oh yeah there's two parts to it. You must put money in the envelope. Oh, I Harry's see. Possibly. Where's it say thirty bucks? Permit fees are Oh I've got some fifty. brakes are starting to work again. I've got a bad habit of dragging my brakes which boils the fluid. I've really got to... I like, yeah, I like to have my foot over, yeah, just covering the back brake so I can use it quickly when I need it. But as a result, you tend to put drags on it. Now I can't fly the drone here, this is a national park and um, yeah, that's a no-no so we'll get through the national park before I go and get the, uh, the drone out again There's a good little trick you can do though when you are travelling through national parks and you want to pizzazz the footage a little bit you can just cut a bit of footage in there like I'm doing right now and even though I'm in the National Park, the drone footage is from the other day. Um, so yeah, it's a little trick you can do sometimes if you got an edit. As long as you're on the same bike and wearing the same clothes and the weather's the same, it doesn't even need to be on the same day. I can't get the drone out through here, it's uh, an interesting landscape. Oh shit!
his grips get really hot when I'm nervous. <laughs> I must be gripping them too hard or uh, oh my body temperature's going up. Well, that was a bit of fun. Um, I'm going to turn these grips down or off. Ooh, black snake or something, brown snake curled up on the road back there. Some kangaroos. Lovely. <laughs> Give <them> a race. <laughs> uh, he's a bit smarter. Oh, that one's off too. Thanks for the show, guys. <laughs> awesome! I did appreciate that emu making an appearance for me. Hopefully we'll get a few more uh, out here. Maybe not running out in front of me though. I think the edge of the road would be nice. Oh man. Ooh. Ooh, look at this. Camp, One Tree Hill. That way. Pretty sure it's this way. Ah, oh, she's a rocky, 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 bloody country. And farmers, you wouldn't be able to pull a plough through here. Yeah. Oh, well, it seems to be right. I can get the drone out now, I think. Yeah, it looks like we're out of it. Yeah, we're on the edge. There's a national, no national park for a while.
the track. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So he got up it, I reckon. Come up for a challenge. Yeah, we'll give it a go. When we come into the property, I went, no, nope, this is dead end. <laughs> there was nothing <laughs> on this road that someone looks like it keeps going. Yeah, that must be a gazetted road. Uh, yeah, that's what it'll be. Yeah, it's gazetted road. Yeah. Yeah. They get in just around here, I reckon. Where's he going? It's over here, the track! Over here! Oh. <laughs> it's hard because the track is barely discernible. This is fucking crazy good! Yeah, I know, right? It's fucking awesome! <laughs> Oh, and the thing is, it's that when you. And it keeps sticking into me bag all the time! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and this is a great thing when you actually travel with someone you take the you know you get off and you take chances like that but yeah, you'd you never do that if we're on our own i wouldn't do it no you'd no i wouldn't because you just go well if you do get in there and break something there ain't no getting back yep Fuck. Um, this is going to take a bit of uh, thinking. <clears throat> we go through here. Up through here. Boop, boop. Or... That's it. Woo! <laughs> 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 
Thanks mate, you go. <laughs> Stalled it. <laughs> Don't know. I think I might have to run 98 tomorrow. It's stalling too much on 91. Whew. Unbelievable. at the moment just to be out here right on such fantastic tracks oh fuck what was that hit me in the boot uh, no it's just 
Oh, oh shit. Mm. Just amazing. This is such a, a fun track. Remote and it's, it just feels like a real <laughs> it feels like an adventure. That's just what we buy these adventure bikes for. This is like 10 times better than the bloody track they're trying to charge people $30 for. Oh, look at this creek down here. This is nuts. It's sandy. Uh, I've lost my run up. Traction control is off. Okay, let's do it. Oh. <laughs> I fluffed around with that a bit. Huh? I said I fluffed around on that a bit. I kind of had wanted to line up a better angle but I thought oh fuck it I'll destroy I wasn't sure how soft it was going to be but it was yeah, yeah. pretty good yeah they're only a 50-50 no great all right keep it moving <sighs> So I'm just uh, yeah, trying to keep us moving all the time now because we can stop and chat for too long and next thing we know it's going to be 9 o'clock and we're going to be uh, actually not 9 o'clock, it's going to be 4 o'clock and we're going to be 300 kilometres away from our uh, accommodation Oh, we don't want that It gets quite cold here once the sun goes down I can't believe it's, you know, it's Saturday, we haven't come across anyone out Exploring these tracks. Which is great, I guess, when they're. Oh, fuck me! Oh, shit! The uh, <laughs> front wheel hit a big rock then and just got thrown out to the side. Um, yeah, well, they're pretty much our tracks today. Good mate. Yeah, good. Bit lost. We're following a red line and it's hard to work out where it's going. I told you, you wouldn't believe me. Park is quite close and out of here. Oh, it is, is it? You wouldn't think so looking at the map, but. <laughs> oh man, that's been so much fun. Do you go out that way often? Not very often, but we do. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. Hello, well thanks man, right. enjoy your day. Right. Well there you go, Dave had the right idea, all you got to do is go up and say hello to the farm dude, he won't shoot you. <laughs> I was just being silly. But um, yeah, oh, I've had experiences where farmers are like, what the hell are you doing on my property? And you know, they make you feel like a real asshole. 
and then you try to have that well it's a gazetted road and then you know everyone's angry so I sometimes try to avoid having the conversation altogether but in this case that was not the strategy to use I tell you, we've only done 170 kilometres. <laughs> it feels like we've been riding all day. Uh, we're a hard, um, some of those are hard kilometres. I wonder what that was. Hmm. <laughs> Coat's got a bit of get up and go. Let's get the fuck out of here! Yeah, they're smart man, goats, they just get off the road. This is bloody well graded, isn't it? When he said it's... For where we are, they've graded it really well. And it's not like they're throwing a whole heap of shit on, like the last lot of shit yeah. I've been riding. Yeah. Where they just, uh, no, this is good. You can do some speed. And that's what we need to do is punch out some kilometres now to get to, so we get home tonight. <laughs> so plugging away still, it's um, oh, it's two o'clock now. We've done 135 kilometres. It's um, we've picked the pace up a little bit now because we're on a, a road that's reasonably well graded, but you know, we're still only doing 50, 60 along here. Um, yeah, so, that's a bit concerning, what time did we get away, it's like 10 to 30, yeah, so, it's taken us nearly three hours to get this far, two and a half hours, so we do need to, uh, make better time on the last part of the track. This is nice and uh, a bit quicker. Why do you love that gnarly track we were doing before? As slow as it was going, it was um, it was challenging on this bike. Uh, I think um, Dave was saying he was loving it. Big grin ear to ear. I don't like these off camber corners with the loose surface on them. Oh, sleeping kangaroo on the road. <laughs> Bunch of them. Little baby and mum. Now have a look at this. This is where we are. So that's where we are. That's the Mount Samuel turn off there. Yeah. This almost looks like it's a thing as well, mm. but I guess we're going to run out of time, so we really probably should just push. So where are we now? Here, this little. Oh yeah, yeah. On the grand scheme of things. Holy shit! <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bit worried. <laughs> Holy fuck! Anyway, I think we'll get here. Do this. I think we'll probably have to cut that out. Yeah. Yeah, and then just bolt for. Yeah, there seriously won't be enough hours in the day. If we got to bolt for here, I guess. This is um, this is this riverbed we're going down at the moment. Um, not sure if it's the way. I guess it is the way. Lindman. Straight ahead, I think. Hot hours. 
least now with a bit of speed we can um, knock a few K's on the head. Yeah, you don't want to roll into a town and they've locked up the fuel houses for the night, get stuck. You've paid for accommodation in a warm bed. Hopefully there is fuel at Blindman. Hey, bit of black top. Three case to Blindman. So I'm going to grab some fuel up here just in case. Um, would hate to run out of fuel. <laughs> been drinking too much, but yeah. <laughs> well, feels like we're back in um, back in the real world now that we're on the on the tar. It was pretty um, pretty epic out there. Alright, well here's Blinman. Um, so we're gonna go that away. But we'll just have a quick look first because look at these historic buildings. That's awesome. Hopefully they've got a fuel pump. Cafe. Mining office. Blinman Hotel. Hotel. No fuel. What are we done? We've done 150 kilometers there, so we've got probably 200 kilometers. Uh, but if we go back and it's more roads like this. The warmer's gone, the sun's gone down behind those clouds and as soon as it did it just dropped four or five degrees. Kangaroos, no more coming. Watch out for those guys more. There's another one over there. He's a big one. Wow. Oh, I hope we can get home okay. <laughs> at a fast pace once we do this track. It's not going to be a fast pace following this guy. Wow, that's just stunning. Oh, look at this. Yeah. Okay, please have some fuel. I think I see a fuel sign. Yes. You little beauty. Diesel, 91. Uh, I'll put a bit of premium in now, I think. 
Oh, there we go. Dave's just been recognised out in public. <laughs> We're about to do Mount Samuel. That's pretty hard, I think. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. I mean, I'm not the best at riders. Okay. Uh, as I said, I come from a road bike background. Yeah. Uh -huh. so, um, yeah, it's probably one of the harder ones around here, I think. Okay, sweet. Well, that's what we're looking for. Yeah. I got some 98 in it now, so hopefully that stalling um, crap I was getting, I think that might have been why. Yeah. This, that 91 was they're not quite tuned for it. But anyway, this 98 should do the job. Alright, well, there's a chance I might stop here tomorrow night. Um, Agarigenus. Oh, 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 excuse me. Because oh. they've got fuel and they've got cabins. Wowie, look at that. Gotta pinch yourself just to remind yourself you're not dreaming. <laughs> it's like it's an epic, epic landscape. I don't know if I'll stuff around with the drone on Mount Samuel or not because it's getting late. We gotta punch this out and then we gotta get back to the um, back to camp before we freeze to death. camping down along this river by the look of it. Now we're talking. Entry, authorised persons only. Hey, buddy. Do you know what that's about? What the Do you know what this is about? This is a man Mount Samuel track, isn't it? Yeah. Where do you guys come in from? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Which way do you guys come from? Oh, we're just coming in, coming this way, and then we're going to do it and then come back, but... Ah, it's supposed to be a one-wayer. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, you go to the Blinman pub, yeah. and then go along that Glass Gorge Road. Oh, you go in the Glass Gorge Road. Yeah, and you turn right into, um... That's why it's okay. Yeah. Happy Valley or, um... Bugger, we were only there. Something Valley, yeah. Oh, okay, because I've been down that glass gorge road. You, you won't get through the gates locked, eh? So you got to pay to use the track, is it? Yeah, yeah. Right. How much was it? Uh, Twenty bucks a bike, I think. Okay, oh, I might have to come back tomorrow and do it. Yeah, we'll go to the Alpana station. Yeah. And um, just talk, see the shield there, Sally, and she'll just give you one of these maps. Yep. Pay you twenty bucks and show you where to go, and then go through. It's a good ride, eh? Yeah, yeah, I heard it was really good. Yeah? Yeah, awesome, mate. Yeah. We're kind of running out of light now. We've got to back, get back to uh, Akarula tonight. Oh, do you? <laughs> yeah. What time is it? <laughs> it's four o'clock or something. Yeah, right. Eh? We're just going back to Hawker, but um, we were going to head to Akarula this afternoon. We thought, ah, oh, fuck it up. If we did this, we couldn't be fucked. So yeah. We even then go back to Hawker and go to Akarula tomorrow. Oh, right. Eh? Oh, we might see you there. Yeah, yeah. Going brother and the old man that would have been past you there. Yeah, I just saw a white coat here and go past. Yeah. And then I think I saw another one. Across the road, and he's going up onto another track down on the other side. Oh, he's probably over there fucking around waiting for me, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just, I just it looks like the he's pulled camera. in, he stopped, although he's probably just going in there to take the piss out of his truck. Oh, probably, eh? Cheers, mate. <sighs> so, what do you reckon, Dave? What do you reckon, Dave? <laughs> but you think it might be uh, a mission tomorrow? Like, are you leaving uh, Arkarula tomorrow? Yeah, I'm thinking about staying on another day. Well, I was thinking come down to this one. So, like pack up at Arkarula, 
come down to this caravan park here, oh, yeah. dump the shit off, do the fucking, do the loop, then we don't have to piss Bob back to Akarula, we can just stay here. Fuel, food, beer. Because mm. by the time we do this again, like, it's, um, yeah, it's going to be... Yeah, I know. I'm a bit worried how late it's going to be when we get back, so we better get moving. <laughs> The sun goes down on an awesome day's riding. We're uh, legging it back to our accommodation now. We're, um, yeah, we're many <laughs> hundreds of kilometres away from where we need to be. Um, which is a little bit scary. But the good thing is I've got a full tank of fuel now. Regardless of anything else, we can um, putter along and get home, even if it gets cold. There we go, some old... Uh, looks like workers' uh, homes on the farm. Pretty cool, eh? Oh, yeah. Worth a look. Oh, yeah, I know, right? And get all these idiots putting shit all over it. We're just going to take this four-wheel drive only. Voltana 17 kilometres. Um, hopefully it's not overly gnarly. Uh, let's do it. So this is um, Lee Creek, but if we go in here, there's a little loop. The only problem is it looks like you know it's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So it's like a 100k loop, so it's probably too much this time of day. But um, anyway, if we head back this way tomorrow, if we decide yep. to do the other track and move our shit down here, we can, always do the loop and we can have a go loaded and... It, see how it goes and if not go back down here set up camp here because that's pretty close to get back to still yeah. yep so that makes sense i think just push on
Loving it, loving it. Woohoo! Look at that. <laughs> 